There we go. Got some light. I'm going to line these pins up. This is a horrible install, everybody, but this is what happens when you don't have a high budget and yeah, like Usher would say. Anyway, so now that I have it seated in there, I'm checking to make sure that it's seated pretty tight. It is. Again, everybody, I caution you, do not use gloves. This is, you know, a no-no. It's a bunch of no-nos in this video. But the point of it is to see if it can run Warzone. If I can take these two with this process with this mega processor and run Warzone <clears throat> now here comes the part where I'm gonna put on the the bridge <sighs> if it's on these two Adjacent slot mount. Yeah, let's see if I can mount the camera. Yeah. Sorry for the audio going in and out. It happens. Apparently they're not lined up. Okay. Now they're lined up. Um, before I screw everything in, it's probably a good idea to test it out. First, let's get some power in here it requires two eight pins sorry everybody I'm I'm really struggling here with this camera and putting on a good show while also actually getting the job done jesus okay here we go let me actually get some stuff done because i can get this done in like half the time if i put my priority on getting it installed instead of giving a pleasant viewing experience but you can be mesmerized by my sexy voice <laughs> and non manicured fingernails I guess but I'm gonna try and seat these in now Okay, looks like everything is in. Alright. So, double, triple check. Make sure everything is in there right. I'm going to try and route these cables around this blower. Um, and there we go. going to go to the back now and hook up the power let's see here let's see what we got here we got a power cable and we got a display port cable 
Alright. Let's get that in. Yeah, it's the right way, wrong way. You know? Professional at work. So, in NVLink SLI, you're going to have a lot more inputs. But I'm going to stick to everything being in the original board and since this is the main monitor I'm gonna put it in the first slot okay I'm gonna switch hands now I'm gonna switch hands now because I can't get anything done All right, now time to plug in the second monitor cable. All right, sorry guys, you can really fast forward a lot of this and get to the good part. Anyway, now that we got the monitor seated in, nice and neat. We got the new board in and we got it powered up. We got it bridged. Let's crank it and see what happens. All right. Sorry, gonna flip the switch. Got the power light right here on the motherboard. We're gonna do it that way. Uh oh. Got lights, camera, action. Okay, let's go to the screen. Let's see what we got cooking on the video of course we got dual screen set up here I have my monitor and I have the HP Omen 65 over here as my main but Right now, nothing's coming up on either screen, and maybe it's because I'm on the wrong input. So, yes, I have video. Now I'm going to switch over to this chair and put on my glasses so I can see. And I have a wireless keyboard. I'm going to be using to control this. Excuse the entertainment center. I also didn't put the fans back on the test bench. Simply because I'm testing it out. But let's see if I can log in. That is my name. Uh oh, I got a window. Doesn't look like the other screen's working. Hmm. Maybe I need to change some settings. Go over to my display. I guess I need to extend it. Uh oh, we got clouds on both screens. Alright, so here's the good stuff. What we came to see. Is this gonna work? 
let's check it out I double clicked it I don't see the little thing I'm gonna keep double clicking there we go we got the hourglass we got the hourglass ladies and gentlemen uh oh it's turning on oh there's an update all right let's do that but while it's updating everybody I want to go ahead and let you know that my username is psychoant so if anybody wants to add me feel free to go ahead and do it that's my Activision Blizzard account and now that I'm done running my mouth I guess we're ready to play but first I want to make sure that the everything is working right so let's go to the dev device manager and see if the drive is being recognized um, so here display adapters oh I got two two RTX 2080 Ti's <clears throat> okay seems like uh, the driver was installed everything is working this device is properly working okay yeah, okay I have the EVGA precision app I know it's gonna let me know if that bridge is working so let me let me start that up and see oh no oh 